的权益Twitch. Sometimes her mouth growls. Hey, Mabes. Mabes. Mabel, are you having a dream? She, like, shocked me. I was, like, just sitting here. And she, oh, there she goes. What were you dreaming? Mabes. Mabes, were you having a dream? started barking like growling rrr, rrr, rrr. <laughs> so I'm back in the kitchen helping my friend uh, who's down and doesn't have nobody uh, we're just helping him do the things that he needs whatever you know not too much but I am now doing an order of small fries which we're gonna do we have nice steak fries, young. I like steak fries. They're better than regular fries. So, we're doing a small order. I'm gonna bring it to it and show you guys. Just throw it into the fryer there. Put that. Put that. Good enough. And let those get nice and brown. So let's see on how those fries are doing. I think they're done. Oh yes, they're done. Awesome. So we're gonna let them drain for a few seconds. Give them a shake. And transfer them to right into our container. Put them back. And then we just give him a little shimmy. Sorry. Frankie is singing. <laughs> so they're ready for our fifth person's order. Put them up here. And I'm free! guys what's going on uh it is monday august 30th uh i'm in the garage here at the house um and i am just going over a few things that i'm looking at just to assess like how much stuff i actually have uh and uh because i gotta figure out whether i'm gonna have to put it in storage some of it and just take what i'm gonna be using in the apartment uh and so far i'm gonna go through what is here and it starts from that point on over there all the way in that space there my bed and the stuff there my stuff here from that point on there and all that stuff all the way to there with the chair here and that is what i owe or I should say own. So I'm just like saying, well, should I rent um, 
you know, rent a storage unit just temporarily just to get to see once I open up all the stuff, then I could always, cons you know, figure out what I'm going to put in my apartment because I'm not going to know, you know what I'm saying? So I don't really know. Um, and I came also by to see if my uh, diabetes uh, Dexcom supplies came, which I don't know because my brother uh, put out more chairs for the uh, thing here and uh, he said he was coming. He must have came already because the stuff here still, they might be out, him and his girlfriend um, and... Uh, I haven't contacted him, but it's, I have to call, um, to set, let them know that I'm going to be, uh, having them take me to, well, not them, uh, Herb and Cody, so they could, uh, help me, uh, move my stuff. Uh, the guy, the other pastor friend of mine, he's not available on Wednesday the 1st because he's working and I don't know about um, the other people that I'm staying with he said he has a truck of course he'd help me and uh, I'm not sure what's going on with uh, that and whatnot so the landlord called me yesterday I got the phone call after church and he left a message and I called him back it was regarding the uh, lease that I signed where my signature was it was blackened out and I think that was a precautionary thing that it does I think Adobe Photoshop or something um, which is a good thing but unfortunately it's kind of a bad thing because then I had to resend it again and that's annoying because you know whatever otherwise if that don't work then it's got to be you know a uh, physical copy which is fine too and all he also mentioned to me he was like well somebody forgot to place an order to the electric company to have meters put in for the building. The landlord's meter is there for the building, but not for the tenants. So he's calling today and hopefully it's in. I don't know if it's gonna affect me moving in the first or whatever. Uh, it shouldn't, so I don't know, but I don't think it's going to. If I gotta stay another day at the people's house, then so be it. They don't mind, they said. So, um, yeah, I mean, I'm back here again, and it's just weird, and I know my brother's probably watching on the camera, but I really don't care. I really only came for, uh, my diabetes Dexcom supplies, but apparently they didn't come, or if they did, they're inside, but he didn't text me anything about that, so most likely they didn't show up. And my doctor's office screwed up again. Because I have to get them. I'm, I can't change the address on them until I get the next shipment. So what's going to happen? I'm going to lose out on them? I don't know. But anyway. So here's on the other side of what I didn't show that you couldn't see. So basically that's all mine too. This too that you're seeing from the other view. So that's basically all what I own. Um, hopefully, like I said, I don't know if this is all going to fit in my apartment. And, you know what I'm saying? Is it a lot for one person? So what am I going to do? Am I going to put everything in a, you know, in, in storage? Maybe I should rent a unit for like a month or so. Just give me time to go through everything and then, uh, then get rid of it and then just get rid of the storage unit whatever i don't know guys i'm kind of debating whether i should whether i shouldn't i don't know